न्यू फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माई चैनल सो आई फाइनली मेड द मोस्ट रिक्वेस्टेड रेसिपी ऑन माई यूट्यूब चैनल एंड दैट इज दिस ब्यूटिफुल तोकबो की डजेंट इट लुक लाइक द वन इन द के ड्रामाज एंड गेस वॉट आई मेड इट यूजिंग इंडियन इन्ग्रीडियंट्स सो लेट्स नॉट वेस्ट मच टाइम एंड गेट स्टार्टेड टू द वीडियो एट फर्स्ट आई एम मेकिंग इट माई वे सो फर्स्टली आई एम गिविंग इट अ तड़का आई एम एडिंग सम चॉप्ड गार्लिक I let it sizzle a bit, and then I add it my sliced onions. You can add onions as per your choice. If you like more, then you can add more. Otherwise, you can even add less. Post that, I even added uh, spring onions. So I kept the greens for later, so that I can garnish it a bit. Then I took red chilli powder. You can take any Kashmiri chilli powder available in the market, but if you want something spicy, you can even add green chillies. Then I added some gochujang as I had some but you can surely replace gochujang with any type of shezwan sauce or tomato ketchup. We also have to add soy sauce but soy sauce has to be a little less because you don't want to lose out on that beautiful red color. Post that you have to add salt as per taste and then water. Once you add the water you have to give it a nice mix and let it boil. We have to boil it first because then the vegetables remain uncooked. Once it is boiled nicely, you have to add the most important ingredient that is tok. And guess what? I again made the recipe for tok. Then if you guys want the recipe for tok, please share your opinions in the comments. I also add some spring onion greens so that it cooks together. After that, you have to put it on to a stove and let it reduce. So you just want it just like this. you have to let all the water boil so that all the uh, taste gets soaked into the tok otherwise then your tok will taste bland and the all the flavor will remain in the sauce just look at this i just loved how it turned out now you can take a nice bowl serve it just like how they do in the kale bangas Tokbuki is a very renowned uh, dish in South Korea, and it is almost you must have seen in all the K dramas. It is really yum. It has a nice chewy texture, and the sauce really tastes yum. I can say you, I can even add chicken into it and eat it, and it will taste so damn yum. If you want, you can even add a boiled egg or sausages, salamis into it to make it non-veg. But I just made it veg version because any veg recipe can be turned into a non-veg recipe by adding some ingredients. Now I just garnished it with spring onions, and the green onions made it look so damn pretty. Yeah. Also, you can't forget the sesame seeds. Sesame seeds are very important for any Korean recipe. So add it. So for the nice crunch. After that, take your bowl and eat it. And I can swear that this will taste so damn yum. And if you guys try out this recipe, do share your experiences in the comments below. And I would love to hear it. Also, if you guys have some recommendations for me, or you guys want me to make any recipe using Indian ingredients, please comment. Here is me tasting. I really need to make uh, like, you know learn my or polish my chopstick skills. It was so yum. I swear it was so damn yum. I just loved it. I even made my sister try it. My sister is a non-Korean like she doesn't like Korean stuff that much, but she really loves the recipe. So here is she trying it out. And guess what? She liked it. and i was so happy because she always reviews my recipes and gives me true feedback about it she loved it just look at her she was shy but she loved it okay bye thank you for watching bye